am so delighted to be joined today by Tara Emson. Hi. Hi. Emson and Company is the leading exporter of Italian fine wine around the world. I'm the proud daughter of Neil Marie Emson, who founded the company. My parents always believed in the potential of Italian wine, the authenticity of what they what they represented, and and standing behind quality was their number one uh, mission. My dad was a visionary and wanted to, to present to the American market what the American consumer should start looking for when it came to affordable quality as a benchmark. And now I think the American consumer, when they're grabbing a bottle of Pinot Grigio, they really are looking for that high quality bottle of wine. So I'd love to talk about the Lavaria and, and what makes it different than maybe all the other Pinot Grigios out there. And you're completely right. I mean, especially nowadays, and the market is completely saturated with Pinot Grigio. Lavaria was started in 19... 75, the winery is called Conchillo. They're our partners. They've been our partners for many years. We've had our longtime enologist, uh, Franco Bernabe. The whole philosophy of Ligaria for us is, yes, it, it is very quality-driven quality and oriented as much as everything that we do. We wanted to make it a very approachable Pinot Grigio. Uh, we wanted to continue to make it something very, very easy. You know, wine at a certain point needs to be enjoyable. And one of the greatest feelings for working women like us is yeah. sometimes to just come home and just pour yourself a beautiful glass of good wine. And just let the day just roll by, you know, and, and just shake it off. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I've been, sh I've been shaking off a lot of days lately, Tara. I'm not going to lie. Um, and I'd love to, talk about, yeah, I'd love to talk about the region specifically because I've spent some time in northern Italy. I've spent some time in, in Garda and Trentino and Alto Adige. So for people who aren't so familiar with the unique position and climate of where you are making this Pinot Grigio. Sure. In Italy, one of the most fantastic regions. There's a whole world behind the label. The height of where the Ligaria vineyards are, somewhere, you know, uh, at, the, at the foot of the Dolomite. The altitude that we're going on here is about 150 to 400 meters over the sea level. And one of the greatest things about this Pinot Grigio is that 90% of the vineyards are actually either on the, the slopes of the Dolomites or on the hills. So you don't have a lot of that valley um, vineyards, which usually are the ones that are a little bit more, the lazier, we call them the lazier vineyards. So there's always a saying that, you know, once a vineyard has a little, it suffers, it always produces the best grapes. You have these vineyards that come from the foot of the Dolomites, you know, this treacherous, very tall mountain range. The grape actually in itself is so much more as you'd like to say, delicious. The original Pinot Grigio had a very classic label to it, and well, we decided a few years ago to go towards a very approachable, very young, modern label to it. Having this Italian lifestyle in mind, we, we decided to have this, uh, the Vespa, which is the Motorino, and this freedom to roam around Italy with the idea of getting a, a classic poster behind it. It's just something relatable. Wine drinkers around the world are looking for something uh, that doesn't break the bank, but they feel like they're getting a great value, and I, I feel like you guys have really done that here. Even with the, you know, with the changing of times, it's it's quite amazing to see how the benchmark now has gotten so much higher. It's probably the most exciting time ever to be a young wine drinker. And if anybody loves the wine particularly, please let us know. Yeah, absolutely. Happy holidays.